10 unique animals you won't believe exist. Nature is truly full of surprises. With more than 8 million species of living things on Earth, no wonder nobody knows or has seen them all. But what if we tell you that lions, tigers, and bears are just a scratch on the surface? What if we tell you that in some parts of the world there are creatures so odd and rare that many people don't even know they existed? Here's our top 10 list of the unique animals in the world. But before we continue, don't forget to hit that like button, click subscribe, and ring the notification bell. We've included both land and sea animals, mammals and reptiles, and even bugs to this collection. So you would see a plethora of unique animals. Number 1. Diane's Bear-Hearted Glass Frog Otherwise known as the Kermit Frog, it's lime green with the transparent skin on its underside that allows the view of its stunning internal organs. Its skin is uniformly colored without any noticeable light or dark variation, and it has silvery white irises with small dark spots, hence the name Glass Frog. Moreover, it has white bulging eyes and its pupils are black and horizontally shaped that resembles those of Kermit the Frog, a Muppet character. It's named after the mother of the scientist that discovered the new glass frog species, Janet Diane Kubicki, the mother of Dr. Brian Kubicki. If you want to see one, you'll have to keep your eyes peeled since these tiny jumpers are less than an inch long. A native in Costa Rica, these tiny creatures can actually be your pet, but they require special care and special climate conditions in order for it to survive in terraria. They usually feed on mostly soft-bodied insects and various species of small spider. Number 2. Satanic Leaf-Tailed Gecko This odd-looking creature even has an odder name, the Satanic Leaf-Tailed Gecko. The satanic leaf-tailed gecko is a rare species of lizard that can only be found on the island of Madagascar. This gecko takes the idea of camouflage to new and absurd levels, because first, it possesses eyebrow horns that look like thorny twig, and its skin is covered with artificial ridges that mimic leaf veins. Its back has splotches of green that resemble lichen and mosses, and lastly, its tail looks like a decomposing leaf. Because it calls the Madagascan rainforest its home, and you'd better believe that this place is a chock full of predators such as snakes and birds, meaning that only the best camouflage variations persist. Though it wears the crown of the best camouflaged reptile in the world, there are still times when it must break its ninja-like cover to scare away predators. To do this, the gecko opens its mouth wide enough to stick out a red tongue and do a high-pitched unearthly scream. For predatory birds and snakes, this devilish encounter may be hard to exercise. The scientific name of the species, Fantasticus, is Latin for the word imaginary, and it was given this name because upon the discovery of the gecko in 1888, naturalist George Albert Bollinger described the lizard as mythical, and we can clearly see why. Number 3. Mycopena microstoma Another animal that has a transparent body part is the Macropena microstoma, or otherwise known as barrel eyes fit. It's called barrel eyes because their eyes are tubular in shape. It's quite unusual, with a transparent, fluid-filled dome on its head through which the lenses of its eyes can be seen. Its tubular eyes are very good at collecting light, and these eyes can rotate within the transparent shield that allows the barrel eye to peer up at a potential prey or focus forward to see what it's eating. Barrel eyes has a tiny mouth and most of its body is covered with large scales, living at the depth of about 600 to 800 meters that nearly hangs motionless in the water. Number 4. Japanese Spider Crab One of the largest known anthropods, it's difficult for fishermen to catch the giant Japanese spider crab because of the depth at which it is found. So, the species is not widely exploited. However, it's considered a rare delicacy in Asia. Japanese spider crabs gets its name from its resemblance to a spider. It has a rounded body covered with stubby projections and long, slim legs. They're also known as decorator crabs, wherein they pick up small anemones, pieces of sponge or other benthic animals and cement them to the top of their carapace to provide the crab a natural camouflage that protects it from predators. Their mottled orange and white bodies, cream-colored undersides, and spiny oval carapaces blends in with the rocks on the ocean floor. 
Despite looking ferocious, the crab has been reported to have a gentle disposition. Japanese spider crabs can be found on the seabed, often inhabiting vents and holes on the ocean floor at depths of 160 to 2,000 feet in the Pacific Ocean around Japan. Number 5. Honduran White Bat one of the cutest of all bats, the Honduran white bat is a prime example of going against the stereotypical myths about bats. They don't live in caves like the others of its kind, nor do they have dark coloration on their body. The Honduran white bats are tiny for a bat, with an average length of 3.7 to 4.7 centimeters. Their ears, face, nose, and parts of their legs and wings are bright orange, and almost no hair grows on their black wings. Scientists call members of their family leaf-nosed bat because their nose protrudes from their face in a triangular shape. There's also a thin black membrane covering their skull that might provide the bats with protection from ultraviolet radiation. These lovely white bats live only in the lowland rainforests that have heliconia plants. These bats cut the side veins of the heliconia leaves and forces the leaves to collapse into upside-down V-shaped tents where they shelter up to 12 bats. However, their tent is not a home sweet home for long, because these bats rarely return to the same tent for more than a day. Like any other bats that sleep at day and finds food at night, these bats roots under their tents at daytime too and start to emerge at twilight to search for food. However, these creatures aren't looking to suck your blood, because they only eat fruit or vegetation. Number 6. Saiga Antelope the saiga that is spread around Eurasian steppe is a small species of antelope, about the size of a goat, which has a stooping body, a large head, a distinctive pendulant proboscis nose, and an unusual up-and-down style of running. Its coat is a light buff color, which becomes thicker and white in the winter. Males have pale yellowish horns that are 28 to 38 centimeters in length. The saigas are critically endangered. Poachers have been hunting the male antelopes for their horns since 1990 because of its lucrative trade for Chinese medicine. Because of this, there is simply not enough males to mate with all the females, which resulted to reproductive collapse and decimation of population. Number 7. Echidna The echidna, or otherwise known as the spiny anteater, is one of the two egg-laying mammals in the world. It has a mammary gland for the sustenance of the young, spines like a porcupine, a beak like a bird, and a pouch like that of a kangaroo. In addition, echidnas only have one opening for the passage of reproductive products, the urine and the feces, just like the platypus. For this reason, echidnas and platypuses are called monotreme, which means one whole. Also, the male echidna has no scrotum. Their testes are internal. They are small and solitary mammals native to Australia, Tasmania, and New Guinea. Though they resemble a porcupine, echidnas are actually a distant relative of the platypus, believed to have evolved 20 to 50 million years ago from an aquatic ancestor. They forage on the forest floor for ants and termites, using their long snouts to capture prey. Number 8. Long Wattled Umbrella Bird this spectacular crow-like bird with a bushy crest is frugivorous, meaning it feeds mostly on raw fruits, succulent fruit-like vegetables, roots, shoots, nuts, and seeds. It inhabits tall, lush, and undisturbed rainforest in western Ecuador and western Colombia. These birds play a vital role in their native ecosystem, as they distribute the seeds from the fruits that they eat across the forest. They're quite scarce usually seen at fruit trees or at known display sites where males may congregate extending their wattles and giving very low-pitched airy hoots. The male is distinguished by a large throat wattle of feather, while females and juveniles have less wattle or none at all. For the birds to reproduce, they engage in lack mating, where males congregate in common areas for display and solitary females visit them. Females then select a male with prominent secondary traits such as aggression and territorial behavior, and after mating, females only lay one egg per nesting attempt. The species is under threat, mainly due to the loss of significant chunks of their natural habitats, with most of the remaining population now found in protected areas. Number 9. Venezuelan Poodle Moth 
Discovered and photographed in Venezuela in 2009 by Tajikistan zoologist Dr. Arthur Anker, this alien-looking moth has poodle-like fur covering its head, thorax, abdomen, and even its wings, thus the name Venezuelan poodle moth. The species superficially appears to be closely related to the Muslim moth. But there are actually quite a few rather closely related moth species that look just as interesting or strange. Beyond that, there isn't really much else known about the species currently. Number 10. Panda Ants Found in the dry coastal regions in Chile and Argentina, the panda ants got their name from their dramatic black and white appearance. Panda ants aren't actually ants at all. They're solitary and don't live in colonies, nor do they have nests. They're also not aggressive but they're parasitic, as they lay their eggs on or near other ground-nesting insect larvae or pupa. The hatched young then uses the larva as a food source. Female panda ants have the stinger, but they have no wing. While the males are larger, they lack stingers, but they have wings. However, don't get too comfortable around a panda ant, because they have another common name of cow killer ants. From the incredibly painful sting they can deliver from their unusually long and maneuverable stinger. Can you believe these gorgeous animals actually exist? Have you ever seen one up close and personal? Share your thoughts with us by commenting down below. Amaze others by sharing this video and remember to click like, subscribe, and ring the notification bell for more videos like this. See you in the next video.